TurboCore, the world's first magnetic bearing, oil-free centrifugal compressor for air conditioning applications. From Danfoss, engineering tomorrow. Safety precautions must be observed during the installation, startup, and service of the compressor due to the presence of pressure and voltage hazards. Only qualified and trained personnel should install, start up, and service Danfoss TurboCore compressors. This step-by-step -step service tutorial will guide you through the verification of the silicon-controlled rectifiers. The SCRs convert the main AC voltage into DC voltage to charge the capacitors and power the compressor. The SCR gates are controlled by the soft start to charge the capacitors with minimum current draw. When AC voltage is known to be provided to the compressor, but voltage or current unbalance is measured, or SCR ripple voltage faults may be occurring, it is recommended to safely verify the SCRs. Prior to verifying the SCRs, it is recommended to verify other components in the AC voltage circuit that could affect the flow of voltage and current to the compressor. Before performing any service on a Danfoss TurboCore compressor, electrical power must be isolated. Turn off the mains input power to the compressor and lock out tag out the mains disconnect. Confirm that the AC voltage is isolated. Wait at least 20 minutes for the DC bus capacitors to discharge. Remove the top cover, taking care not to touch any components underneath. Then, using an appropriately rated voltage meter, check the DC bus bars for DC voltage level. If the voltage is above 5 volts DC, wait 5 minutes and recheck until voltage is below 5 volts DC. To verify the SCRs, they must be isolated from the other compressor components. A grounding wrist strap must be worn when handling ESD-sensitive components. Remove the soft start. Snubbers. SCR gate cables, AC mains bus bar, and the DC bus capacitor assembly. Using a multimeter set for diode measurement, place the negative lead on the AC input, terminal 1, and the positive lead on the positive DC output, terminal 3. The reading should be 0.3 to 0.45 volts. All other terminals should read open in both polarity directions. Set the multimeter to resistance measurement. To ensure there are no shorts, verify the terminals are open to ground. To verify the SCR gates, measure the resistance of the gate terminals. All three should have similar resistance of 1 to 25 ohms. To ensure there are no shorts, verify the gates are open to ground. If no issue is found with the SCRs, verification of other components in the main AC voltage system may be required to determine the cause of voltage or current unbalance or SCR ripple voltage faults. Additional details can be found in the service manual or the TurboTool app. This concludes the Danfoss TurboCore SCR verification presentation. For more information on Danfoss TurboCore products and service documentation, please visit us online at turbocore.com.